<laughs> you're, you're not fitting well. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, uh, we just want to kind of do a daily recap of our Monday. Um, today I was it was my second day of the ultimate reset, um, and I'm feeling completely depleted and aggravated and emotional and. I would agree with that. Yeah. So anyway, I just made a delicious dinner though. It was a Southwestern tacos and they were good. Which is really good. I was starving and the food was good. And uh, what was it about last night? The food last, last yeah, night? last night we, I made the nori rolls. Um, one thing about the Ultimate Reset, you get these awesome recipes that are completely clean. Um, and it's really big portions. So I'm, I'm really liking that. Um, the Ultimate Reset's a great thing. I'm trying to do like a video diary kind of an unbiased review of the ultimate reset so everybody kind of knows what to expect if you do it because it is a big uh, process if you decide to do that but Jason also embarked on P90X today yeah today was my first day of my hybrid so I just finished uh, my first 30 days of asylum and that finished uh, yesterday and today was my first day of hybrid so I'm actually hybriding uh, P90X and Asylum. So today was my first experience with uh, the Tony Horton. And uh, how do you like Tony Horton? Well, that's different than Sean T. I mean, right now my preference is with Sean T. Because you're just so used to him. I mean, I went through with him with Insanity uh, twice, and then with Asylum. And so it's definitely different getting instruction from Tony Horton. But I will have to say that I definitely felt that like this was one of my today was chest and back. And then I'm about to do um, Ab Ripper X in about 20 minutes. And I was absolutely exhausted. I mean, my muscles were, I mean, I almost, again, I almost passed out. Uh, to, yeah. I was exhausted. Yeah, yeah, it was a good workout. I almost passed out from the Ultimate Reset. So, anyway. Which was yesterday. Yeah, yeah. I, I did the, started the Ultimate Reset yesterday and I tried to do T25. Almost puked during T25. Looked up at Jason and said, "I can't finish." And that's the first time I've felt like that. Um, I think it was a combination of um, terrible Thanksgiving decisions by food, and it just goes to show when you feel your fill your body with crap that you perform like crap. And um, we both experienced that yesterday, actually. Um, Her head was hurting. I mean, she was moving up and down, and all of a sudden she was just like, "My head's killing me." And so I was, "All right, I'm going back to bed." And then I heard a thud. I, I came back in. I thought she was. I thought yeah. she was dead. But anyway, we both had a really hard workout she wasn't yesterday. Dead, <laughs> I'm not in the mood today. See, this is what the <laughs> ultimate reset does. So anyway, she's on edge. We both had terrible workouts Don't yesterday. Let her smile we, fool you. we still got through them. Um, we still did them. I actually quit with two minutes to go, and I would normally never do that. But she's I just not a quitter awful. by nature. I mean, yeah. her yeah, her father taught her better than that. I just felt awful. But you're also not supposed to be working out on the Ultimate Reset, and there's a reason for that, and now I know why. Because We may get that, yeah, we may do uh, Tai Chang. Yeah, Tai Chang is what is approved for the Ultimate Reset. Now, I know there's a lot of people who, after the first week, are able to do their normal workouts, which I'm hoping to do, because um, I'll have kind of workout withdrawals if I can't do that. But the Tai Chang, which is a part of Beachbody, one of their programs, um, is actually what they want you to do. A lot of meditation and soul searching during the ultimate reset. So, But they it's, say it's a pretty good workout. Yeah. On a, uh, and on a, on a side note, I'd like to mention uh, kudos to my mom for uh, ordering hip-hop abs. Good job, mom. Uh, I told, yeah, right? I know. I told her, I said, pick any program you want, and I'll go ahead and, and I'll buy you a uh, you know workout program to, to get... Uh, to get started, and, and my mom said hip hop abs. Apparently, she's uh, she took one one listen to that with Sean T, and, and she was in. So uh, I know that uh, her and my dad are uh, are shopping for some uh, some loosely fit fit clothing, um, and uh, yeah, she said she's always had a thing for R and B too. So she we'll has some high tops, so I think it'll work out well. Yeah, we'll she see loves it. Zumba. It'll be she does have high tops from like '85. Remember those Reeboks? Mm -hmm. Yeah. She loves them, but that's right. Yeah, they'll, they'll do well at that. Yeah, Your dad's abs. doing hip hop abs too. Yeah, and the rocking body. Yeah. And his underwear. And pink robe. God help us. Anyway, um, happy Monday, everybody, and we'll kind of try to do a um, 
brief synopsis at the end of the week of my ultimate reset. I'm trying to document everything as best we can, um, but Jason will also be posting sexual pictures of himself doing P90X <clears throat> and insanity. I never thought it would be so exhilarating to take selfies at 36 years old, but it just, let me tell you something, it just doesn't get old. A you selfie get, is a selfie. You, is get, a, you get one more confidence point every single time you post that. Well, I try new I try new flex moves as I'm trying to take the picture. I think when I, I may have to move up to that iPhone 5S because uh, the screen's, you know. The best or, part is like you see these pictures where people take selfies and they'll change like the, the filter so that their muscles look really huge. But you don't even know how to do that, so he hasn't got to that point yet. So once you get to that point, it's like a no. But it's your like head's the, just gonna go. It seems like the faucet gets bigger though. I, I do it in the same. I try to I try to get some continuity. Yeah. So I, I do it. Today in my, you I left my the little the little bath squeegee in the background. I did. How'd you see that? I saw it. And it was fun. I felt awesome. I knew Tony would be proud, so I said, you know what? I haven't done a selfie in a little while. So uh, you and, so, and Tony would be best friends. I, I actually think that, uh, yeah, Tony and I would actually would actually get along. Um, I don't know when P90X was filmed, seemed a little younger then, but I think now I would, I would probably, I'd probably I, I, like what he's, I like the way he moves. I agree. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, so we're going, and um, I'm going to sleep. I can't even think straight, so. She's, yeah, she's going to take a nap. Nap as in I'm going to sleep for 12 hours and get up for work tomorrow. So, anything else? Sit. All right, we'll see you guys later. All right, guys.